No, it's not a Cold War. It's an out-and-out -out battle. And it isn't just straight people. Every gay guy I know is running off to Hawaii, putting on a caftan, reciting vows, and feeling superior to me. Caftan? Oh, yes. With orchid lays. <laughs> Aloha. <laughs> <laughs> I miss the old times when everyone was alone. Now I'm just starting to feel like I'm an outcast in the outcast. Carrie? Oh, my God. <sighs> Joe, hi. Wow. Jeez, it's been years. I haven't seen you since you were, um... Straight? Well, I was gonna say in Miss Saigon. Oh, still am. Uh, Love Miss Saigon. Oh, this is um, this is my friend Stanford. Hi, and this is my life partner Lou. Oh, wow! Well, look at that. Well, oh, congratulations. <laughs> Where are you registered? Barney's. I was kidding. <laughs> so, Carrie, how about you? Are you married? Oh, not really. I mean, no. Are you thinking what I'm thinking? Perfect. <laughs> what? Well, Lou and I are interested in having a child. We already have a surrogate, but we need a top-notch egg. What are your feelings about donating one? Oh, listen, here's our card. You think about it and give us a call. We'll pay. Yeah. Great seeing you. I had just experienced single bashing for the new millennium. I was no longer even considered a person. I was now an egg farm. Meanwhile, in a park downtown, another single woman was about to be humiliated. Miranda was obliged to attend her firm's annual softball game. A law firm softball game is like any other, except when a lawyer steals a base, he gets promoted. Miranda, I was afraid you wouldn't come. All right, let's get it over with. Panicked at the idea of spending another firm function labeled as a leper, Miranda had agreed to be fixed up on a blind date. Miranda, this is Sid. Sid, Miranda. Look at you two. It's like a perfect match. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm going to uh, excuse myself. Nice to meet you. You too. I tell you what, I'm going to get a soda. You want a soda? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I'm going to get right. us a soda. Okay. Jeff? Pretty great, huh? Can I pick him or what? Yeah, I'm not gay. Seriously? Man, I've been with a firm eight months. I haven't once seen you with a guy. Circumstantial, Jeff. I'm single. Christ, when did being single translate into being gay? Shit. Uh, you want me to go over there and... No, I'll do it. Brave Miranda marched right over and told Sid she wasn't. They had a good laugh and decided to stay and play ball. Miranda and Sid's last inning double play got the attention of everyone, even the firm's senior partner. That was quite a play, ladies. It's all about teamwork, Charles. Uh, Chip. Chip. Listen, uh, my wife and I are having a little dinner party on the 12th. Uh, just some couples, nothing fancy. We'd love it if you both could make it. We'd love to. <laughs> Later that night, Miranda gave me the lowdown on her day. So you think it's just because they think that you're in a couple? I know it. I've been with the firm for two years. He's barely even spoken to me. All of a sudden, it's Chip. A lawyer named Chip. Gotta love that. And they seem so relieved to have finally figured me out. So you're actually going to go through with the dinner? Yep. I'm determined to make partner in this firm, even if I have to be a lesbian partner. After Miranda left, I had a thought. Maybe the Cold War isn't about hate. Maybe it's about fear. Fear of the unknown. Married people don't hate singles. They just want us figured out.